And these are a very unorthodox matchup on both sides. Because you see, Snake's going to really try to get you with those trades on the grenades. And Olimar's just going to try to throw the Pikmin at you and just ship you to death over and over. And the grenades are really good at killing Pokemon because out of nowhere you can just say there's a giant hitbox of remove your Pikmin if they're not next to Olimar. Snake already with 47, 74% on him. Working hard and it's not, it's just not enough. These Pikmin are chewing him up. He just gets to call him back like that. He's trying his hardest though, trying to like space him out so that he has he can get rid of the Pikmin and get to, get to go in. But the yellow Pikmin back air. Pick more. Down air doesn't hit. Cypher hits him though. Not quite. The wave bounce grenades, C4 as well. But he's got these Pikmin on him. He's just taking little chunks of damage. He's at 178. How did that even happen? I feel like I just I feel like this match just started. He's already dying to up air with blue Pikmin. Alright, we got a purple and a white. The white's on him. Let's see what he gets off of it. He's taking a lot of damage for that, but he was able to get the Pikmin off. He only has one Pikmin. He's gonna pick more in the right in his face. Pulling out just three more Pikmin out of nowhere. Yup, there they are. He's really showing why Snake's neutral is not good enough to play, to play against Olimar. He used the Cypher to extend the hitbox. Snake has to go high again because he's got really nothing else. The Nikita hits, almost dies to the up air. Not quite. Deflects the purple Pikmin, but he's just, he's just getting beat up. There's just too many Pikmin to deal with. Like, what can you do in this situation? You, got, you really don't have much to work with. What? The grenades aren't enough to cover it. And look at that, he's back to 170. Basically any straight hits here is, is going to kill, but the Nikita, he let it go midair and it fell. Olimar thought he was gonna go out sta off stage after that. Not quite, but that forward air will do it. All right, we well got a purple, a red, and a yellow on deck. The purple's really good for annoying people off stage, but really slow to get up and be useful. Really meaty hits. Snake really has a lot of work cut. Snake has his work cut out for him. He just took so much damage from that red Pikmin F smash. And the grenades really are not doing it for him. Swigzy's showing his Olimar knowledge. Great tech from the snake though. F smash doesn't kill. He rolled through it. The snake's at 121. Olimar's trying to kill him. Didn't quite get it. F tilt at platform. Drops the C4. Throwing the grenade. Oh, up smash hits. The, the mortar came back down. Nikita, not quite. Up smashes. Read the roll. Down throw. Ooh, he get up attacks. Very, very good response. He Snake thought he was gonna roll in, but no, he got he used the get up attack and back throw just kills. Wow, we we've seen a lot about snakes getting suffocated today, and this is just part of it. Snake really didn't get to run his game plan. None of them really have been able to. They've been really, really played well around. The bombs weren't enough, and Olimar's chip damage over and over was enough to just grind him out into dust and stomp him out of the game. Let's see. Swigzy really showing a commanding knowledge of the matchup between Snake and Olimar. We'll see what Bobo does to come back. Bobo needs to make a few adjustments, and he'll get this going right. All right, getting back into it. You know, you got to rest, reset. You lost game one. There's still game two. We're in winner's quarters. You know, you stay calm. Take a breather. You know, you got these yellow Pikmin on you. Let the bomb get it off. Double dash attack questionable. Although the up air hits. Red Pikmin up air. Ooh, we had a little bit of confusion going on over there between the two players. Purple Pikmin fair. Get to ledge, roll, spot dodge. He's really trying his best to let these bombs hit, but they're really just not working in his favor. He's just racking up percent out of nowhere. And these straight hits hit, hitting him so far, making him choose through how he wants to recover. The air dodge didn't make it to ledge. You hate to see it if you're a snake player. We've all seen a snake deal. We all know how sad it feels to have that happen to you. Although we're seeing a bit more of adjustment in the neutral. He's playing it a little bit closer, losing, trying to use the bombs less, trying to throw hands with Olimar more. But Olimar is just telling him, back up. Really using those Pikmin to his advantage, saying, I don't want to fight you. Get away from me. He goes, I want to fight you on my turn. So let me rack up this percent, get her ba get back, and then I'll just... Look at that, he ran across the whole stage just to try to grab him. 
You really gotta, you really gotta be some kind of maniac to play Olimar, man. Look at this. Rolled forward through Pikmin, rolled back to where he was originally. And he's just racking up percent. The air dodge doesn't make it again. Snake is really getting chewed up out here. Olimar's alive at 108. Up tilt will kill, though. DI will not save him. All right. Snake's got, a one, Snake's got one chance, one opportunity to seize everything he ever wanted. Let's see if he can capture it. Down air. Dash attack. It traded. Here comes the bomb. A lot of explosions at ledge, but Olimar stayed patient, waited. Swigzy, with that patience we're seeing again. Really picking his moments is Olimar. Really, really using that drift from the momentum carry on upbeat. The Nairs. God, watching Olimar always feels like such a such a battle, and I'm not even the one I'm not even the snake playing. And I feel tired watching this. He just gotta work so hard, and Olimar just gets to throw those Pikmin. He missed the F-Smash. He thought the dash attack would go through up till it hits, and now we're eating. One to one on stocks. Snake has 86%, but he's got to work for those kill moves. Snake's not a light character. Oh, where is Olimar? But the purple Pikmin up smash. That purple Pikmin, he's a fat, he's a fat one. And those hitboxes are deceptively big.